So what we need to do first is we need to pump this up so it can put pressure in the bottle so that it can send it through the fuel line to get it ready. So we need to put some pressure on here. All right, now we're done putting pressure and we just need to turn this on. Then we need to twist this. And we just need to light it. We don't want to use this fire for in order to cook, so we need to let it burn around the rim so it can be a blue flame. This is the flame that we want. It kind of sounds like a train. sizzling and now we're gonna hit the igniter. So we're gonna let it boil for two minutes and then after that we're gonna add in the noodles for three to five minutes. So I've already showed you two different gases. I'm gonna show you another one. So this one is really good because it's really lightweight but one bad thing about it is that it takes a while for the water to heat up. And this one is called an alcohol stove, which you use alcohol, where you can get it at a camping store or a hardware store. It's called the denurtured alcohol. So we're gonna, I'm gonna show you how to use it using our Katadin water bottle that we got, which is really cool because it's about filtration system where you can just pick water up from the stream and it will filter it. And then we have a Helinox chair that we also got. And so now we're just gonna show you how to use the alcohol stove. So we already added the denatured alcohol, so it's been sitting in here for a little bit. So this is actually a really cool stove. So it's pretty simple how to use it. It's a clear flame, so that means you can't see it. But when it's ignited, all you have to do is you just have to play this over it, and it just kills the flame because it runs out of oxygen. So let's ignite it. So this is a really cool because it's a clear flame. But you also want to really be careful because... You might burn yourself because it's clear and you don't you can't see it so how to tell is you just want to put your hand over it if you feel heat then it's on then you can just kill it by putting the lid over it which takes away the fire's oxygen and just kills it so now we're going to see how long the alcohol stove takes to boil its water so let's see it all right now it's on and let's cook some water so let's put the pot on the stove and see how long it takes to boil so i got my timer with me and we're gonna, we're gonna see. This one doesn't sound like a train, it sounds more like a jet engine. This guy's not be talking about the Helinox chair. This is a really good chair, I'd really recommend it to you. It's really great when you're outgoing, it's cooking, it's about 2.1 pounds, so it's really good for carrying on a backpacking trip since it's so light, but it's also really good when you cook. And because the stove is about like right here and you could be stirring, you could be putting, putting food in. It's just, it's really small and so it's really good for cooking. That's also really light too. So yeah, it's called the Heal and Office Chair. You guys should really buy it. It's really good. So guys, we're about six minutes and a half, and it took about two minutes to boil on the jet boil. But this one, it, it's really light, but it takes a while to, to boil your food. That's the only bad side about it. So it's starting to boil. We're about at 12 minutes. So you could also use this to block the wind. So you can, you can open this up so it can, can block the wind. I never got the water to boil, but I hope it's hot enough. So guys, um, I'm not really impressed by the stove. We had to stop the timer twice just to refuel it, and it's been about 25 minutes. And so, yeah, and it still hasn't boiled yet. So guys, this stove kind of sucks. Like, we had to stop it, like, twice to just refuel it, so man, that kind of sucks. See? You can see it. 24 minutes and it still hasn't even boiled yet. We gotta stop it twice. Just refuel it, man. 
So guys, we've, we've been about deciding for about two hours now, and we've decided that we're going to give this away to one lucky person who can have this, even though it doesn't really work. They can just use it for, like, hot chocolate or apple cider or coffee. Or they don't have to use it all. could also just sit in their basement or something. I'm not really impressed, and I do believe there's a better alcohol stuff out there. Just make sure to leave them in the comments. Oh, wait, they're disabled, so I guess we can't now. <laughs> so, guys, this is about the end of this video. If you guys did enjoy, please like, please subscribe, and also please share it, guys. I'm going to see you all in the next video. Bye!